it was always a place where it was so amazing to come when I was younger. Coming from a city down to Cornwall was so different and it was so beautiful to come down here and it always filled me with just peace and excitement and to see my family down here as well was always an added bonus. I have my auntie Sue who lived here and my two cousins Sam and Jamie. We would just have so much fun just exploring outside was just so much better down here it's so much more beautiful. Aunt Sue was one of the happiest people I think I've ever come across in my life. She was always so enthusiastic about things. She was so kind, she was so funny. She was so similar to my mum. That's why we had such a good relationship. Sue was diagnosed with lung cancer. She came to Mount Edgecombe Hospice. When I was told that Sue was going into a hospice, I was like, Sue's going to die so soon. That's what I thought a hospice was. I didn't know that you could go there to recover or to, to get better. And I came and visited her a couple of days after she first came in and I couldn't believe she was sat in the chair. She was watching the birds being fed out of the window. She, you know, wanted to go around for a walk and she was just really healthy. She did have a couple of stays at different times. She came in and then they would nurse her back to a point where she was out of pain and she was comfortable and then she would go home again. So it did wonders for her, it really, really did. In the last week of Sue's life, we spent virtually every day here at the hospice. I was allowed to stay with my cousin and we were given beds. We were allowed out at whatever time of the morning we wanted to just come and sit outside, get some fresh air. There was always someone to offer us support, a cuddle, to take us aside and just talk to us about what we were worried or concerned about. To know that Sue was cared for so amazingly is something I'd never forget, ever. I signed up to trek the Great Wall of China in October 2014 to raise money for the hospice. It made me feel a bit better and like I could give some gratitude back. So 